you fishy folks and welcome back to Michael's Fish Room. It's been a while. Here comes a rant. Alright fishy folks, welcome back. Before I get into it, and I'm, I'm gonna get into it, do me a favor. Hit that subscribe button if you haven't done so already. Gently boop the notification bell. And check out my website, michaelsfishing.com. Also, I'll be trying to put some Amazon uh, affiliate links in the description for Prime deals that I've seen for you guys. I've been trying to post them on my Facebook page, but uh, if you're watching this on Wednesday when it's released, you should be good. All right, folks, rant time. And I haven't done one of these in a while, and I gotta watch my blood pressure with the heart attack and all, but. So, I've been hanging out in some of the Facebook forums, Facebook groups, um, you know, just kind of seeing what's going on, seeing what people are doing, specifically seeing what my competition is doing and how they try to promote themselves because I, I haven't really been promoting much because I haven't need to. I, 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 I'm almost at the peak of how many boxes I can ship a week comfortably. You know, I'm shipping 20, 22 boxes. That's a lot for one guy. I do it all myself, right? And I have a real job and I have a family, whatever. And so I haven't been promoting much, but I'm thinking maybe I should see if I can go to the next level. So I'm, I'm trying to see what they're saying, but I've been hanging out in the groups. Cookies Fish Room is one of them. Love this. It's the best Facebook fishy group, in my opinion. I mean, I'm being paid to say that. No, I'm just kidding. I just like it. It's just a good group. And the the guy who started it is Norm. He's a, a real deal marine biologist who knows what he's talking about. And here's, here's the point of the rant. Don't answer a person's question if you don't know the answer. And how could you know the answer if you don't have all the information? Now, this is just a generality. It's pretty close to the truth, but I really am not trying to call anyone out here. You know I normally would, but I'm, I'm trying not to. So, the OP, the original poster says, something to the effect of, my fish keep dying. I don't know what to do. I lose a couple every week. They're guppies. So, the first person is like, well, what are your water parameters? Which is exactly what they should do. They should, we need all the water parameters. We need the temperature. We need the GH and KH, if you're, especially if you're talking about live bearers. We need to know when you put them in the tank, what the filtration is, what else is in the tank. We need all of that. But no, there's nothing. The second person says, I would do an immediate 50% water change and add two tablespoons of salt. Why the heck would you tell somebody to do that when you have no idea what the problem is? Sure, guppies could be dying because nitrates are high, or nitrites are high, or ammonia is high, but you don't know. So don't suggest it. Then, 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 after that, somebody else writes, Oh, I would do a 25% water change and watch them for a week. What's watching going to do? This person doesn't know anything about fish, clearly, or very little. What's watching them going to do? They don't know what they're looking for. So then I say, what are your water parameters? And I spell it out what I need. And I wait. And the water parameters never come. And somebody else answers again, I would do this, and I would do this. And so finally I answered, why would you tell the OP to do that if you don't know actually what the hell you're talking about. And this Karen got upset. Why do you have to be so mean? Why do you have to be such a bully? I'm sorry, Snowflake. I, I just, I can't fathom how you could answer somebody uneducated. Now, I'm not saying they gave you all the information and you gave the wrong answer. I'm saying they gave no information and you gave the wrong answer. Because you're an idiot, Karen. Now, she didn't like the fact that I called her Karen. In fact, she's like, is that the best you got? No, Karen, I have plenty more, but I'm trying to be nice because I didn't start, you did. Eventually, it ended. I decided it's not worth my time because she was a Karen know-it-all blowhard. So I ended it because trying to keep my blood pressure down. You know, heart attack, June 14th. It's only October 14th. So it's only been four months. You didn't even see me count on my fingers. I counted on my head before I said it. I, I just, I can't fathom. If, if you're watching one of my videos, 
And you have questions. I try to answer them, right? I try to answer every comment. Now, I've been bad lately, bad host, but I try to answer every question because I like to educate. I like to teach you guys. That's why I put out videos that might not do so well, like what is the cycle? That video is bombing. It's got like 2,100 views. That stinks. It's a good video. It's a great, to me, it's a great explanation of what is the cycle. I'll put a link up here. If you've watched it already, watch it again. If you haven't watched it, watch it twice. Um, and these people that, that ask on, on Facebook, when is Mike Guppy gonna give birth? Oh, this is a good one. Is Mike Guppy pregnant? Yes, all female guppies are pregnant. They're born pregnant, okay? I love when they ask, when is Mike Guppy gonna give birth? I don't know. Let me check my magic ball. I, I always use that gif, the, the magic, the crystal ball. Because if you told me my guppy gave birth 22 days ago and look at her, she looks like this, I would tell you she'll probably give birth in X amount of days based on how boxed off she is, the color of the, the pregnancy patch. You know what I'm talking about. I can't remember what it's called. You know, the, the patch. Anyway. <sighs> Trying to calm down. Trying to calm down. The other thing is, when people say, I just bought new fish, and all the rest of my fish in my tank have started dying. And you're like, well, did you quarantine? No, why should I do that? Like, all right, I get it, you're a newbie, but just do a tiny bit of research. Just, just a skosh of research would tell you, you need to quarantine beforehand. That's it, that's all you need to do. All right, folks, that's it for the rant. Quick and dirty, just like I like it. I hope you guys like the rant. Comment down below the worst thing you've seen on Facebook. The dumbest question asked. See ya. I love when they ask, when is my guppy gonna give, when it? I love when they have mush mouth. <laughs>